can give you a difference between a Zulu guy and a petty guy. Like a Zulu guy is so cool. When he tells a story, make sure you understand where the story started and where it ended. He has time and energy to explain. On the other hand, a petty guy doesn't care about you. He wants you to figure out the story by yourself. <laughs> Let's say a Zulu guy was beating someone somewhere. He'll come to you with that energy and of course, the accent is from Isivan. You understand that somebody went through a proper beating. On the other hand, doesn't care about you. They don't even waste time. It rocks up to you and go like this. translator who's paid. This guy never wastes time. And you know those Nigerian preachers? The guy who can go like this. Ah, the Lord is talking to me right now. <laughs> Many people love making the situation of the pastor as if it's theirs. Modemo <laughs> The Lord is saying I'm uh, going to receive our blessing tonight. The vehicle I've been praying for, the house I've been praying for, the promotion I've been praying for. This thing will happen to you right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I can tell you because I believe that the Spirit of the Lord is moving in this place. Yeah. This is how it goes. As I'm talking to you right now, one woman will receive our blessing. One woman will receive our blessing. I don't know why three times, but one woman will receive our blessing. This thing will happen to her right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Kaba baba bosha kabaria kabaranda. Kaba baba bosha kabaria kabandoro. Kaba baba bosha kabaria kabayaro. This thing will happen to you right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I'm going to go to the hospital. 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 I'm going